Okay, to get started, we first need to go to our Synology NAS main page and then go to Package Center and then install a package called Media Server. So we'll find that in all packages in Package Center and then go towards where Media Server is, click the Install button and it will then start to install the package we need. Now, while we're installing this, just make sure that your LG TV and your Synology NAS is actually connected to the same network. This is crucial. And um, this could be over Wi-Fi or other net, but just make sure it's connected to the same network. So once Media Server is installed, we're actually going to head over to the file station and we're going to put in a sample video into the correct directory so we can stream this to the TV. Now, under the main route, you'll see a folder called video. Now, in order to stream the videos, we must put video files or subdirectories inside this video directory. Okay, I've got a video file prepared already, so we're going to head over to the file and we're going to copy and paste this and put this in the video folder for you. So that should copy over and that's copied pretty quick. And pretty much that's all we need to do on the Synology NAS. So we're going to head over to the LG TV now and show you the next part. Okay, so now we've just gone over to the LG TV and then we've switched it on and then we're going to press the home icon on your remote control. And that should bring up a menu on the lower right hand side and we're going to scroll over until we go to a photo and video option, as you can see here. And once we click that, that will open your photo and video section and then you should see the Synology Disk Station appear as an option or a, like a media source. So if it does appear, we're going to click on this and then we're going to go to your video folder. This corresponds to the video folder we added the video to in the Synology NAS. So we're going to click on the video folder and now we shall see the sample video that we put in the Synology NAS and we can play that now. And as you can see, it's a lovely roaring fire. And that's pretty much it. If you want to put in more videos, simply add them to the video folder on your Synology NAS and your um, LG TV should be able to pick up those new videos and stream them straight away. If for some reason the, the list doesn't update with the, with the recent videos, um, you can basically switch your TV off, wait a few seconds and switch it back on again and then it should refresh the list for you. Thanks for watching, please like and subscribe and I shall see you in the next one.